Hit it. Welcome back to the Frank Smoke channel. Uh, it's been a while the last time I posted a video. Um, I want to thank every single one of you guys that subscribed to the channel. We are getting close, guys. We're getting close to almost 1,000. And to be honest, my first video that I made in my channel, one of the first one was um, how to all model your Honda Accord. I decided to share uh, my experience with that car because particularly that car, even though it's a Honda, it's a really hard car to modify. And for me, it was so hard to, to find content. I decided, you know what? I've been struggling so much to find content and do stuff with this car that I, I feel like I want to share it. So shout out to every single one of you who subscribe to follow the Honda Accord Bill Smoke. Uh, I want to thank everybody who subscribe when I own the Type R and especially lately, uh, people who subscribe since I got this car for my wife, the 2021 C43 AMG. So I wanna thank you guys. Uh, please share this video, subscribe. Find me some subscribers, man. Like uh, 1,000, it would be amazing to have 1,000. Uh, I'm a truck driver. Um, maybe I can even share some of uh, the things I do with you guys. And it's something I wanna explain to you guys real quick. Uh, Sometimes we spend so much time on social media, right? And this time, if you go to, the, you have an iPhone, right? Oh, you, Android, doesn't matter. And you go to the settings and you see how much time you spend on social media on each app. You see that sometimes on Instagram, you, you're scrolling, you spend hours a day, uh, WhatsApp, Facebook. And in my case, uh, the the app that I use the most is YouTube. I like to watch YouTube. Uh, sometimes just listen to the audio uh, even though I cannot watch the video, I put it on on the on the Bluetooth on the truck when I'm working, listen to you know learning stuff. So YouTube for me, I think it's a more uh, an app where we can take advantage of it. So if you whatever you do, I want let me be your first subscriber. Let me be your first subscriber. It doesn't matter if you do real estate. It doesn't matter if you work in a fast food restaurant. Just share the content. The difference between YouTube and the other apps is that this one uh, you can maybe make some money back. You know. So let's um. Let's everybody make YouTube our first, uh, I would say, app, uh, app that we use and we can share content. I leave it that alone. So I'm gonna show you this uh, as park assist of the C43. I think it's really nice, it's uh, really practical, especially if you uh, live in a crowded area uh, where you know it's kind of hard to find parking sometimes. And sometimes you don't wanna, you, you know, even though you have 260 camera and everything, you know, sometimes you're just too tired, too stressed, uh, driving an hour or more in traffic to go back home. And if you see a nice spot, but you're not even sure you fit, well, the C43 will do that for you and it will show you. And I'm gonna show you that right now. All right, so when you're driving, right? You're driving, you're looking for park. So you have to, the car have to be on drive, of course. You start moving the car, you start driving. So you have this uh, button right here, this one. So you press it there, and here you see this uh, this line, blue line. That's the parking sensor. So the car right now is starting to look for parking, uh, calculating the space between cars and everything. So we'll see if we find something, and we'll see how what the car is gonna do when it feels like it find a spot where you can fit your uh your c43 um i think it's smart enough to calculate when it's a driveway so it won't let you park in the driveway it will let you just park okay still looking for parking i think i feel a nice spot where i can park so maybe right here between these two cars so let's see if it's gonna show me all right Or maybe between these two. Okay. It says that it found it. So 
let's we press this one right here to confirm and now it's telling me that go in reverse so put it on reverse and now as you can see my feet isn't doing nothing my hands are holding my hand I mean I have my hand not touching holding the phone and as you can see it's parking now the first time I freaked out I don't know <laughs> you see the sensor the sensor are active the first time I freaked out right and see it's turning by itself and it put it on park by itself amazing how about that how about that a car that give you performance a car that look nice and also park by itself so I feel I have to show you this to you guys so let's show they show you uh, different angles so you can see it Alright, so I literally get off the car, car's still running, so it's gonna see uh, how close to the sidewalk you are. That's another thing that, well, in this part that I choose, uh, the sidewalk is, is not there actually, it's, it's really uh, wear out. But, as you can see, the, the rims, they, the sensor help you to not mess up the rims and stuff. As you can see, this car right there, a little far, I'm a little close. So this sensor, this one right here, it will protect you to not mess up the rim. So you are a person, like most uh, most of us, like you don't want you don't want to damage your rims. This park assist will help you. Uh, the car, it will never you damage your rims uh, if you use that, uh, this feature. Right, so I'm trying to look for a little, uh, maybe more a tight space, because uh, I choose the uh, space between cars here wide enough, but I wanna put it to the test, right? So I wanna see um with a space a little more tight and with a better location for uh with the sidewalk right so a little more sidewalk so you can see that the car will protect the rims so let's see if we find someone okay so uh, i think maybe between this taxi yellow color and this maxima i think we can try to do it right here sidewalk is pretty nasty there so let's take a look okay pretty nasty sidewalk there All right so let's park it between these two so i guess we're gonna choose this angle yeah Calculating and go. So go here, press there, configure the reverse, and you can just relax. No hands. See, I have my chest, well, my arms crossed right now. I'm a samurai or something. As you can see, no fool in the gas. And it was closed, but we're good.
perfectly parked, perfectly straight. Uh, this thing behind the car, this thing in front of the car. Let's get out and take a look. around six seven inches legal the maximum is 10 from the sidewalk and the brakes so it will be safe for the green okay guys i hope you like the video uh for the next video uh i have this right here so we're gonna check if the number that mercedes proclaimed they are true so i have Okay, you're gonna see because the camera angle, but this is the draggy. This is the draggy. So my next video is gonna be to see how much does for real uh, zero to 60 times, uh, quarter mile times. And I'm gonna do it on the street pretty much. I'm gonna try to find a safe spot to do it. But eventually my goal is with this C43 is uh, take it to the drag strip, take it to the drag strip to see how performs on the drag strip, a real one, as uh, the quarter mile, you know, with the, with the, with the surf, uh, surf more prepared uh, for drag race. And if I found one, it is possible, if I have the time, to the track, to see how performing the track. Because you have so much performance in this car, at least once you have to take it to a track to to, to handle, you know, to see how it handles, the, the, in the curves and you know and everything so but that's gonna be the next video we're gonna check it out how we do zero to 60 um with the draggy so i want to thank every single one of you that has subscribed um uh the great comments that we have we have great comments like 99 percent has been positive there is always one or two that have been hating on like some guys over there like saying that i got sucker and then and uh, i got screwed I, I was screwed by the saddest person from mercedes and blah 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 i'll put the screenshot as you can see just people just love to hate for no reason i click on that guy video um name on it to see and it seems like he got youtube just on december of 2020 something like that so you're gonna tell me you hating on a mercedes but you just got a cell phone and with internet on december 2020 and you have YouTube, or maybe you couldn't keep up paying your phone, and that's why you have to get a new phone in 2021, 2020, and, and with a new number, a new account. So it just, people like, doesn't even, people just hate for hating. But screw those people, I wanna take the positive comments uh, that, you know, inspire me to keep doing videos and keep sharing uh, anything about this car and my project car with you guys. So thank you guys, see you next time.